Question 6, Z is a molecule that uh, contains uh, carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. And Z only uh, has alkene and carboxyl functional group. So alkene means CC double bond, carboxyl means COOH. Okay, complete this table. See uh, what you get uh, when this reagent reacts with the Z. So, because uh, in the <clears throat> in this molecule it has CC double bond, when we add bromine water in there, so the orange will decolorize because bromine added to the CC double bond and because it has COOH it will react with the carbonate and form CO2 gas so you see freezing or effervescence or bubbles forms okay for part B is very easy uh, you should know what to do uh, just find the mole uh, the percentage over the mass of the elements so you get the mole the ratio you should get or one to one ratio so empirical formula you should get CHO for this uh, figure 1.6 uh, there is a very important info uh, so it's given 116 and 117 from here we know that 116 is the molecular ion M 117 is M plus 1 plus 1 means one mass uh, one extra mass unit okay deduce the molecular formula of Z from using this uh, mass spectrum very easy uh, in this mass spectrum what you need to really get is uh, the mass of the molecular ion which is 116 from here we know that the molar mass is actually 116 okay just now we get the empirical formula we need to get the multiplier uh, so we just use the n times the CHO okay then uh, this one over okay 116 over this value so you get n equal to 4 so we know that molecular formula must be C4H4O4 Okay, after that, uh, using figure 6.1, suggest the formula of the fragments that form with M over E at 45 and 71. Uh, 45 here and 71 here. Uh, it's better for you to deduce the structure now uh, to get the, the correct fragments. Okay, so the structure of Z is this one. The C O O H C H C H C O O H. Uh, it's quite easy uh, to deduce the structure because uh, it's C four H four O four. So we start with uh, four carbon, and because four oxygen, and we know that is carboxyl, so it must be a dicarboxylic acid on each terminals. After that we have to add the double bonds there double bonds we cannot put here or here must be here so complete the hydrogen number so we get the structure right okay how to get uh, m over e45 this molecule it can uh, undergo bond breaking anywhere once it's undergo bond breaking it will form radicals and the radicals will further ionize to form the uh, cations Okay, so to get 45 very easy, let's say the bond break is here. So you get COOH. COOH itself is 45. So means you can put COOH positive or square bracket positive or you just use CHO2 positive. Okay, MOE is uh, 71 is actually another part, this part. C H C H C O H. So this one you just put a positive charge here, right? Or you can just give the molecular formula. Or uh, means C3H3O2. Of course this is better. 
right? And of course, uh, the last part, part three, suggests the structure. I already told you uh, how it looks like, how to uh, deduce a structure, right? You can give this one or this one. Okay, that's all. Thank you.